Hey guys, Ivan here, and now we're watching Dexter Jackson's posing routine from 2019 Mr. Olympia pre-judging. Before this Mr. Olympia started, everybody had Rolly Winkler and Brandon Curry battling for that first spot. But some people had Dexter Jackson winning it. And that would be amazing, that would be his 30th pro victory in a row, and his second Mr. Olympia victory. He's already Mr. Olympia champion, he won in 2008. But based on what we see right here, it doesn't really seem that he can win the Mr. Olympia. His waist got out of control, his stomach is a little bit too protruding, but that's something that we expected, that's something we saw at the Tampa, but the Tampa Pro lineup was not as strong as it is today, of course, in the Mr. Olympia. Aside from that, if we're talking about his weaknesses, sure, he has no calves, but he won the Mr. Olympia without any calves, so that's really not the problem, judges don't really care much about it, but let's speak about his conditioning, that's the main thing. And fullness, of course. So he's full, he's pretty full. For a 49 year old, <laughs> he's very full and very muscular, it is actually crazy how his legs are staying this full. I mean, with age, first thing that goes is usually legs. But his legs are actually getting better. Last year, the Mr. Olympia, his legs were much, much worse. So very good addition of Dexter Jackson. If you ask me, I don't think it's better than Tampa Pro. I think Tampa Pro, he was a little bit sharper. And this Mr. Olympia, he looks a little bit flatter, maybe a little bit watery. But I'm sure this can change for the finals. I'm sure he can be a little bit sharper for the finals. We'll see about that. But as for now, he's good enough to be in the top six. Yeah. And uh, him being in the top six really means something. I mean, that means he shouldn't be retiring anytime soon. And these are the shots that really pull a lot of points for him. Back shots, back lat spread. Look at this. Look at the details in his glutes and his entire back, pretty much. And back double bicep even more so. Those are his strong shots. From the front, it's not really that good, mainly because of his midsection, but side shots are also very good. I mean, he has good abs, don't get me wrong, but uh, his waist just got out of control. Most muscular, though, very, very good pose for him. He's overall very full, but I think he's a little bit too watery. A little bit more than he was at Tampa. If he was a little bit sharper, he would be up there, you know, battling with Hardy and William. But uh, as for now, no way he can beat them. He cannot crack the top four. Top five or top six is like the best case scenario for Dexter Jackson this year. Anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching. Like the video, subscribe to my channel and leave the comment down below. All the best, guys. Bye-bye.